Hey everyone, how we doing? I'm just doing a basic uh, scent before workout today. Uh, Las Tens or Vein. Getting my summer stuff together here. I'm pretty sure I featured this on the channel before. Check it out. I've only had this since last summer. Um, I spray this stuff. Nine sprays for me on this. Evaporates in three hours. I can change up my fragrance after that. Um, it'll be after gym. It'll be done. My skin will eat this stuff. What are you guys wearing? <laughs> what are you guys doing? How's your fragrance journey going? Brand and therapeutic fragrance. We're checking out Hermetica today. Uh, Multi Lotus review. Little color of the juice. I've already got one review up. Hopefully, I post that first because there's some important stuff in there. Anyways, guys, stay tuned for the review. All right, we have another Hermetica Multi Lotus. I don't know if I'll do the whole line. Um, I'll try, just try to do an overview of the best ones I like. Um, they score decent for what I think about. It's, it's a different line, totally different fragrances. Check out the top of the green line review where uh, I put up the big banner that says Talk Hermetica. It's about, I think, five minutes long, something like that. Check that out. And um, it's the thoughts on the brand and, and what it is. It, it's a different brand, different perfumes. Um, I think there's a big place for them in the market. For us big time frag heads, I don't know if you're a frag head, check this out. If you're new to fragrances, uh, this is a place to start to get your nose on just basic nuances of, of fragrances. Um, this is about Multi Lotus, we're gonna keep it that way. $195, 100 ml, under $2, an ml in Eau de, Parm, Eau de Parfum format. Launched in 2018 for our five of Fragranic with only two votes. Might have a lot more votes by the time this uh, gets uploaded. Uh, I've seen this in a lot of people's hands on IG. And um, yeah, so we'll see if they update their Fragranica notes. They're out of France. This is a freshie. Build is unisex. These are 50-50. Uh, the Oud one maybe is the only one I would put 50-50 so far. I, I think I have like two others to try besides that, but so far 50-50. Uh, notes on Multi Lotus, Bergamot Essence, Green Fresh Molecule, Floral Fresh Molecule, Osmanthus Absolute, Jasmine Sandback Absolute, yummy, love that one, Modern Musk Molecule, and Sandalwood Essence. What is Essence? What is essence? I want to see my source sandalwood. Anyways, sandalwood essence. All right, there is some spooky science going on in these fragrances. What you are familiar with, is it there or is it? it these play with my head. Uh, you smell close, it smells just booming strong. You pull away, you pick up a couple different notes is in the siage. You, you smell it close, those notes aren't there on uh, close to my skin. I can't smell, at least with my skin chemistry, whatever. The, the sillage, they float and I can smell them just soft, gently, like they're brisking in the air. It, it's a trip. These, these are different. They spray like an oil. There are no alcohol in them. Uh, different perfume. I feel like I'm gonna have an eight Foot sillage, you literally, it's under two feet and it's not even strong. It's just airy, fumy, uh, nice. If you like the smell, that's what you want to give off. You're just giving it off in the nicest, the politest of ways, even though you should smell it close to where you sprayed it, you think you're going to bomb somebody. Uh, it, it's a trip. <laughs> it's a trip to, to try one or two of these just for that reason. None of the sampling I've done and previously in my fragrance journey have I ever seen this done. So um, it, it, they have some patents on their stuff. So looks like scientists are moving forward in fragrances again uh, with this house. All right. Everything about these that I've tested so far are better than synthetics that I'm used to. I, I can say that on record. And you, you guys know me, I hammer synthetics. 
Yeah, on the fragrance, this is some ninja stuff going on here. It uh, Now you see me, now you don't. You put it up to your skin, it's one fragrance. You take it away, the Siage is a totally different feeling. Not that it's huge differences, but you just get power blasted when you put, uh, wherever you sprayed it, when you put it to your nose, you get this power blast of a scent. And then in ninja-like form, it's not even there. But this air, the air atmosphere changes around you. It, they're different fragrances from what I'm used to. Yeah, let's get into it. Fragrance compared to the notes. This is a bright opening. I have, this is a bright opening like the flowers are sitting on the water. Like the, 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 the flower notes are like you see the little ponds on top of ponds. Um, kind of like they're sitting there and you're just getting a, a wet vibe, a, a little earthy vibe, not mossy. I almost said mossy, but not really mossy, but a green, wet, airy, fume uh, a vibe from the top. This is the hydrosol musk that I've seen them use in other fragrances. Uh, again, the, the powdery notes in here, the fragrances I'm used to, usually they turn powdery. Whatever they're doing here, they, nothing explodes. None of these fragrances explode. Whatever synthetics they're using, whatever I'm used to, only two, maybe three more to go, but nothing explodes. They just stay calm, pleasant, not much of transition. I talked about that other video, but for people who just, what they sniff on a tester and want that on their skin, this is the one for them to look out for. Definitely the same musk that was in Green Lion. The sandalwood essence is nothing special on this soft white wood. You don't get that yummy butter sandalwood. Uh, even that the synthetic sandalwood that I'm used to, I have right here, uh, gives you, at least not mixed in with this, it might, in their notes, but but mixed in, you're not on my skin. It didn't pull off like that. Um, that being said, 100% well, well blended. So nothing comes out on its own. Every note just plays together and to form uh, just a lovely perfume. Top heart and base is pretty much all the same on it. Throughout the wearing, the bergamot was soft as ever off the top. Maybe that burned off and transitioned out, but nothing strong. I wouldn't even call it a, a strong citrus, but um, there's something on the top that did leave that was soft, airy, had to be the bergamot citrus. Uh, I wanted sandalwood so bad that I actually applied my sandalwood after wearing this, uh, uh, just to compare what real simple it is versus their essence. And it, the, I, every note in here plays soft. It, it doesn't shout. <laughs> For me, I like more shouting fragrances. I like more transitions. Uh, again, these are for people, if you're just getting into fragrance and finding this, sample this house. These are for people that don't like my fragrances, that don't like changes in fragrances. That I see a big need for this house in the market. That's why I'm reviewing it, but on the channel, um, not a, nothing against them. It's, it's probably, if one makes it my collection, one might, but overall, it's not what I'm looking for in fragrances. You guys know what I get passionate about fragrances. I mean, I don't, but what the stuff I like is not mass market. That's the difference. I think they're onto something here that could be, if you're going into business into fragrances, I think they are gonna hit the jackpot with what they are. They're just people who work every day, who are very routine and I mean, they buy the same shirts and stuff. Nothing gets there. It's mass. It's a mass market. This is the perfume for you guys. It's not going to turn you off. It is it's going to perform how you want it. Easy going. You know, make you nice smelling. So huge. And it won't be a big freshie. It won't turn anybody off. I, I think these guys, this house is on something huge. Not for my collection, but uh, for my business mind, I'm like, wow. Wow. Seriously, I hope I say all that right because uh, there's no need to hammer this house. Huge need for this in the perfume market. Scoring, a multi, scoring, multi lotus, hermetica, addictiveness, originality, 11 out of 15. Projection, siage, 3 out of 5. Longevity is a 3 out of 5. Composition, 18 out of 25. Ingredients and price to ML, 15 out of 25. 
top, heart, and base. Top is an 8 out of 10. Heart is a 4 out of 5. Base is a 7 out of 10. 69 is the total score. Decamp this. Try it out for yourself. <laughs> where, where do I see this being worn? Uh, a, a ninja. This, this is very personal scent, but nobody will see you coming. But you still smell it. <laughs> oh, my mind sometimes when I do these win one wears. I don't even know if you guys like these. When do I see it wearing all year? Kung Fu fighting. Who do I see wearing this one? Jack Chan. And how many sprays? Three to five. All right, guys. That's what I have. Multi Lotus. All right, guys. Peace out. Be blessed.